Hello, I'm Paul Tranny, and here's some things that we added to Photoshop for the iPad that I don't want you to miss. I'm gonna start out here on my desktop because if you open up a file that has missing fonts, you can go ahead and sync or resolve those Adobe fonts. So that's how that works on the desktop, and that's exactly what I've done. Closing that Photoshop Cloud document, I'm gonna open up that same file over here on my iPad. So here I am on my iPad. We could see that same file, right? And I'm gonna open it. And if you blink, you'll miss it. Basically what just happened is it synced those uh, Adobe fonts. So it's basically Adobe font auto activation. Happens behind the scenes, happens fast, and I can go in and edit it and do what I need to. I'm gonna add a little bit more to this really fast just by coming in here using select subject to magically select that deer, mask it out, and make this look a little bit more magical. But in order to do that, I'm actually gonna jump into Fresco. So basically, if you purchased a Photoshop subscription from the App Store, you now get Fresco and all those premium features. So those thousands of brushes, 100 gigs cloud storage, all that fun stuff to play around with all day long. And feel free to use some of that content in your file like I did here with that fun little bird and making the scene look a little bit more magical. So check them out today, both of them. Thanks so much for watching.